now we will see 14a question 9 new book please correct here it should be 7 here it should be 8 okay please correct this should be 7 this should be 8 here they already give us the mean the mean it is equal to 62.8 then what else they give us? Sum of all frequencies. That means if we add all the frequency here, we will get 50. Then what we have to do? We have to find the missing frequencies. That is F1 and F2. So we will use a direct method of calculating mean. So for that, first of all, we need to calculate the class mark. So class mark, remember, upper limit plus lower limit divided by 2 20 plus 0 20 20 divided by 2 we get 10 then here 40 plus 20 we get 60 60 divided by 2 we get 30 then 60 to 40 100 100 divided by 2 we get 50 so there you see it will go on to 70 90 and 110 so those then we are doing with direct method so now you multiply f and x that column we call it as f i x i so 7 into 10 we get 70 then we have f1 into 30 this one has alphabet <coughs> so we can place it separately then we have 50 into 12 again we will have 600 then 70 f1 here they have alphabet let us put them on their own and next we have 90 into 7 so it will become 630 then last but not the least 8 into 110 so remember we have to plus them in order to get the summation f i x i okay so when we plus remember not to add those which have alphabet we will add only 70 600 630 880 7 plus 3 10 we have 18 and then 6 plus 1, 7, 13, we have 21. Then this 2 also we cannot throw, we have to add. Plus 30 F1, plus 70 F2. Then now here also we have to plus total frequency. We do have two alphabet, F1 and F2. So write those two separately because we cannot forget it okay because i aim to get those so 7 plus 12 will be 19 19 plus 7 will be 26 26 with 8 will be 34 so now here we have this is the total frequency from the question we get 34 plus f1 plus f2 but from the question, they give us total frequency is equal to 50, which means that these two are the same. Okay, so remember we have total frequencies. N equal to 50, but here we get 34 plus f1 plus f2 equal to 50 this is plus with no number we can take it aside f1 f2 also if we leave both one side it become problem let's take one outside okay so 50 this is plus bring the side become minus then f2 also let's leave it that side plus if you bring the side it will become minus so here we can leave f1 equal to 10 minus 4 6 4 minus 3 1 plus f2 we cannot do anything name it as equation 1 then next let us see the next part because mean they already give us 
so let us use that formula only to save time okay so remember x bar it is equal to summation f i x i if we do by direct method by the total frequencies so mean we already have from the question it is equal to 62.8 then here we have <coughs> summation f i x i we already get from here it is equal to 2180 plus 30 F1. Summation FIXI we get 2180 plus 30K plus 70K. So we'll take that same one only. Here has no decimal, we can bring it the other side. Okay, sorry. In the denominator, we have the total frequency that is 50. So now we can cross multiply since one this one is denominator, this one here. So 62.8, we can cross multiply with 50. It will be equal to 2180 plus 30 f1 plus 70 f2 so if you multiply this one see what do you get okay pause the video and multiply you'll see we get 3140 those because one decimal we can put one number after decimal this one has no alphabet we can take it that side then it will be the side we are left with 30 F1 plus 70 F2. Then here now we can minus. We will get 0, 9. This number after decimal we can throw it. Okay. Then 30 F1 plus 70 F2. Everywhere we have 0. So let's divide with 0 to make the number smaller become 96 3 f1 plus 7 f2 because each part we divide by 10 after we divide now we cannot do anything but we already have f1 equals 16 plus f2 so now we will do substitution in equation 2 okay 96 let it remain 3 let it remain but in place of f1 we can write with 16 plus f2 okay in place of f1 we can replace from equation 1 then plus 7 f2 remember we get it from equation 1 not whole only part okay but it's uh, the rest remain from here only only in place of f1 we replace with this one so now we have 96 3 into 6 18 3 1 3 4 plus 3 f2 plus 7 f2 sorry here we have this is plus when i bring this side it should be minus so here also press correct it okay it should be minus then here also we will have minus this is plus take that side become minus 96 minus 48 then 7 minus 3 we get 4 f2 16 minus 8 will be 8 9 become 8 minus 4 4 equal to 4 f2 so we want only f2 we divide it 48 divide by 4 Finally, we get F2 equal 12. Okay. Then remember, we still want F1. We replace it in equation 1. So F1 
it will be equal to 16 minus f2 that means 16 minus 12 we will get 4 so that means the f1 equal 4 f2 equal 12 so 12 plus 4 we have 16 16 we plus with 34 we get 50 so that means the answer is correct